Shout out to Brian Major, my favorite rock hound, my favorite YouTube uh, crystal collector. Um, I was lucky enough, I got to meet him and dig with him at Haunted Ridge. So making a shout out video here to support him and encourage everybody to maybe consider becoming one of the crystal collector supporters and just support rock hounding in general, even if you can't like afford to purchase any pieces. It's pretty cheap to go out there and just look. And just doing that helps. So I wanna show off everything that I've got from him. Um, I just found out about Brian like last August, so haven't even known of the guy that long, much less known him. And check out the amazing stuff I got here. Everything on this little green vinyl sheet here is what I purchased. I forget exactly what it was, but it wasn't much. I think like $20 each for these crystals, $20 for these Utah Trilobites, and I think it was like 30 or 40 for these three Druzy pieces. Gotta add some different Drews to my collection. So we got Purple Heart, um, Herkimer, New York, and Diamond Hill, South Carolina, Druzy pieces. These are all the things that I got in giveaways and for free on the Crystal Collector supporters. And a few of them were extras that came with these purchases. In the monthly giveaways, I won some Bismuth, some Topaz Crystals, and some Pyrite from Missouri. I'm hoping I can find where that's at. And also got some Purple Heart Amethyst, Oklahoma Selenite, Florida Calcite, whoops, uh, Fossil Fish from Wyoming, Oklahoma Selenite, and the Utah Topaz. I did have one more piece of that, but I gave one of those to a friend for a birthday present. That's not even the coolest giveaway stuff, though. My son Cash, he gave this awesome chunk of amethyst from Thunder Bay. Unbelievable. So Brian's a cool guy. Also, his nephew Dylan gave Cash this calcite clam from Florida. That is super cool. I love that Druzy calcite in there. And Cash also scored his own little topaz. The favorite thing that I got though is this rock that Dylan gave me at Haunted Ridge. It's a rehealed piece of Drew's Quartz. And I think it's just amazing. It broke inside the pocket and it revealed that layer of beautiful crystals underneath and then it rehealed. And I think it's just an amazing metaphor for overcoming adversity and how like scars can sometimes make us more beautiful. So that's my favorite piece that I got because I got it while I was digging with them. And we didn't even know what it looked like till I cleaned it up. Knew it was something special though. So that's cool. And now, Let's get into this box. This is a new thing that he started doing for the Crystal Collector supporters on Facebook. Dollar a month and you have an opportunity to make special purchases and win some cool stuff. This is all stuff from the Southwest. Got another cool card here. Awesome, thank you, Brian. Yeah. This is what I was excited about, those Pecos Diamonds. I gotta get my 
tray here that I was going to get to set everything on. Alright, let's look at these Pecos Diamonds. From Roswell, New Mexico. Wow! Those are so cool. These crystals are like if the Missouri Drews and the Herkimer Diamonds had a baby, I think. So weird with that red color. Awesome. Let's see what else is in here. Ooh. Petrified wood. Arizona. The most colorful wood in the world. I would tend to agree. Oh, wow. Oh, this one's stuck. Little piece broke off of that one. Still cool though. Awesome. Ooh, the Utah selenite. I'm gonna save that for last. I know that's awesome. Oh, got some of them blueberries. Azurite and malachite sphericals from Utah. These are really cool. Pull these little guys out. Whee! Okay. Don't know what this is. Oh. Pyrite from Knit, New Mexico. Ooh. Cool. Maybe fool's gold, but it sure is beautiful. Guess I'm a fool. What else do we got? Calcite. Terangula, Texas. Weird. Oh, okay. I think this is like a bunch of um, fossils. Cool, oh wow. I didn't even see that. There, there's the calcite. Cool. The matrix piece that it's on is all like fossil shells too. That's awesome. Sweet. Okay. I think that's it. The rest is just paper here. And we'll get to these Utah selenites because I know these are going to be sick. I watched the video where they were pulling these out. Wow. Ugh. It's like Christmas. You wrap this one up good. Make sure and get that little tag. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's several of them in here. Okay. Good. Just paper. Out of here. Ooh. Wow. Yeah, definitely do not get anything like that in Missouri. Wow. That's cool. Looks like there's three of them in here. Let's see what else we got. Some of these had yellow phantoms. Yeah, there we go. That's so cool. These crystals are just so unbelievably clear. One more piece here. I feel like it's a good one. Oh yeah, it is. Save the best for last. Wow. Look at those phantoms. So cool. All 
All right, well, there you have it. That's what you can get being a crystal collector supporter. Yeah, pretty cool, huh, Merlin? I suggest that you consider supporting Brian, and if you don't want to support Brian, at least support yourself and your fellow rock hounds. Get out there and look, and um, show some love to your fellow rock hounds. They will probably show you some love back. Maybe a lot of love. Thanks for watching.